We are responsible for public health services, hospital services, uh, behavioral health services, and community health center services. What you will see is that these different uh, sectors of the health system work together to address population health and improve the health of the, of the CNMI. What is very unique here at CACC is uh, the multi-alignment of resources within CACC. Uh, what I mean about that is we're, um, we're under one house, we're under one management, and it brings an efficient, effective, uh, collaborative delivery of service and all level. With Typhoon Sotolor, you know, when we were hit by a super typhoon that destroyed a lot of homes and basically shut down water and power for over a month, we were able to respond. We were we, we did not have to go through any specific channel to be able to uh, to take care of the problem, especially in in a in an emergency situation. By having every service under one roof, we were able to to ensure the protection of our patients. We also ensure the safety of our, our community members. We do try to have a multifaceted approach to engaging the community and providing good public health services. Um, it can run the gamut. Uh, UC is out there trying to give you flu shots right now for the seasonal uh, flu vaccines. We will be out there to do uh, well child visits, we do preventative uh, services for women um, in terms of placement of IUD, doing pap smear, breast cancer screening, etc. We also engage the community in terms of educating them about the risk of non-communicable diseases which are very highly prevalent here in the CNMI including mm -hmm. high blood pressure, diabetes, and educating them how they can have an improved lifestyle to mitigate those diseases and then come in for care. So that's providing the linkage from public health mm -hmm. primary prevention into clinical services. So each of the programs or bureaus will have their own strategies strategies, policies, implementation as to how they engage the community, educate the community, and provide the necessary services in collaboration with our local and federal uh, external partners. Cameron Community Health Center is a federally qualified health center. We're the only such clinic on the island, so we provide low-cost, uh, effective, evidence-based primary care. We collaborate on multiple levels with the Department of Public Health. We have several uh, projects ongoing at the time. Uh, we participate in the disease registry with the Department of Epidemiology, so we're turning in numbers of patients with fever, viral illnesses, and such. We also collaborate with the Non-Communicable Disease uh, Bureau, and uh, with that collaboration, we've established the first diabetes registry in Saipan, which we're really excited about. So we have people come from public health to do education for our diabetic patients. Um, which is a great project. We've seen vast improvement in our diabetes uh, patients' care based on this ongoing project with public health. We also work with public health on a large hypertension project. We've been trying to lower the rates of hypertension in the CNMI. Over the last six to eight months, we've been working on this project. Our particular role in the project is to do clinical services. So if patients are screened and identified with high blood pressure, they're sent to our clinic for um, ongoing care for their hypertension. One of the examples that we have for is, is the, um, the substance abuse uh, and the substance uh, issues in, in the CNMI. The convergence of community servicing programs under a unified system at the Commonwealth Healthcare Corporation allows for ease of access to services for patients. It also allows for streamlined care and a seamless integration between behavioral health and medical health. We see a vast population of people at our clinics and our hospital services, including public health and behavioral health, routinely serve women, for example. Through our collaborations, we are able to provide holistic care so that education, prevention, treatment, and intervention gaps are met. 
despite the fact that we have limited resources, we are located in a you know, remote location, we are able to, to take care of, of, of issues right that, that comes to our front door without hesitation, without a uh, question of who's responsible for who, because we all know that uh, we can work together better that way.